Hello, uh, my friends from YouTube. Uh, welcome to my channel. Today I'm gonna show you how to um, order a right part of any electronic device. Everything you do is in your own risk. I am not responsible for any damage that you cause to your device. This uh, video is for education purpose only. Thank you. Okay, before you uh, tear down or open an electronic device, please um, wear one of these. It's called anti-static bracelet. You can buy it in any computer store or online. Okay. Um, okay, this, uh, this is a HP laptop and, and the model is um, HP TPM Q204. Okay, uh, before I used to order parts from um, just following the model of the electronic. But then um, when the parts arrive, uh, they, they, they come in, in the wrong size or they have a connection different, different connections. So since then I learned that the best way to, um, to order an electronic um, replacement part is by following the, the part number of the part. Okay, so in this case, I have this, um, like I said, this HP. This is a HP laptop. And the problem is that this, this the mouse pad, it doesn't work anymore. More. When, when I'm, I'm using the computer, it starts like, um, it doesn't respond at the touch of my finger. So I'm going to replace this part, but first I'm going to open this um, computer and remove the part. So I will show you how to do it, okay? Okay, so this model, um, this HP, we need to remove, um, you can see here, so we need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven screws. But first, there is a little plastic here, okay? So we need to remove this little plastic first. See, and I always um, put it in a bag so you don't lose anything, okay? So let's move the plastic first. Okay, I'm gonna pause my video sometime so it won't be super long. Okay, as you see, I removed the, the seven um, screw covers. So now I'm going to remove uh, all the, the, uh, the screws that you see over here. So I need a uh, Phillips screwdriver. I need a bigger one, so hold on a second. Okay, so now I'm going to remove the screws, the seven screws. And I have this magnetic. Okay, so I'm gonna stick all of them here. Okay, so let me pause. Okay, so I removed the seven screws. Okay, now that I removed all the seven screws, we need to remove two more. So these two, okay? So just remove the plastics and put it inside the box. Okay, so you see I have two black screws right here. Okay, so I removed the two screws. Remember, the two black blocks screws goes here. Okay, one here, one here. Okay. Okay, so now with this tool, opening tool, just uh, go right here. Be very careful, don't go so deep because sometimes there is cables and that's just try to pop up all this like that be careful so you don't damage the, the this part of the computer be 
procedure. If you not be careful, you can scratch this. If it, is, if it is your computer, so that is no problem, but it's somebody else, you have to be careful. Okay, you see? Okay, here is some, um, we need to go very careful because there is a cable attached to the, from the motherboard to the mouse pad. So always when you uh, use the tool, hold it like this and with another finger like this so you don't break there. And then just go. So I don't know, this is the cable, look, see, I don't know if you can see it, this is the cable attached from the motherboard to the mouse pad right here. Okay, so use this tool here, or this one, and try to pop it like this, and you see come out okay so now we're gonna disconnect the cables be very careful here okay right here I don't know you can see it right here you see so we need to uh, I'm gonna use a flat mini screwdriver okay to right here I don't know you can see you need to the white thing go up push it up right here I don't know you can see it I'm trying to show you here push it up like that and then pull it okay and now we need to disconnect the this cable the keyboard so the black goes up okay and then pull it okay this is like a tape here so be careful okay yeah be careful when you remove this tape because you can if you break one of this, if you tear down one of this cable, then the keyboard won't work. Okay, so we have that. So let's remove this one. Put it out of the way, and then now we're gonna remove this. We're gonna remove the, the mouse pad because I'm, because I'm gonna replace this, so. Hold on one second. Okay, so I need to remove um, five screws. One, two, three, and, no, oh no, six. One, two, three, four, five, six screws, okay? side yeah be careful with, with the tiny screws because sometimes they uh, jump 
and then you never find them. Happened to me before. Okay, this is what I do sometimes. I keep the screw over there and put a tape so that way um, I don't have to deal with too many screws later. Okay. Okay, so let's put it in the box. And then I have one more right here. Okay, so I got it here, you see? I got the cable and I'm gonna, I'm going to uh, the screws back and I'm gonna put a tape, okay, same thing. Okay, as you see, I removed the mouse pad and, uh, and the right part number is this one. I don't know if you can see it, but uh, it's this one right here. SB4598 22H5. That's the right part number. That's the way uh, you order the part. Because if you uh, order the part following the computer mo model, they might send you send you a different one. Okay, so now let me show you in, on on the website um, what's the what's the part. Okay, you know, so I wrote down here the the part number. And this is the computer model. Okay, so now let's go to uh, ebay.com. I buy parts from eBay. ebay.com okay so now I'm based. so now I'm gonna type these numbers that's a part number so so it's a SV 459 a mm. Um, 22H5 and then search okay you see that they sell the whole thing but I'm and then it's 80 dollars but I just want the mouse but I don't want the keyboard so right there look mm. you see it's the, exactly the same the same model and you see looks the same look see it's the same okay okay guys so that's the way you are um you are the right part number of any electronic device it could be a computer cell phone um radio tv whatever always order by the part number okay don't order from the model of the device because uh so, like i said sometimes they send you a different one or or doesn't fit okay thank you so much i hope you like my video please subscribe to my channel give me like and uh, check my other videos thank you so much have a great day